What's going on guys? In today's video, we're gonna see how you can take all those amazing presets that you've downloaded from people and get them off your computer and load it onto your Line 6 Pod HD 500X. Let's get into it. To load presets onto your 500X, you're gonna need to use the Pod HD 500X edit software. If you don't have this already installed on your computer, you got some work to do. First, go to the Line 6 website, go to the navigation tab for downloads, under the dropdown for choose hardware, Scroll until you find Pod HD 500X. For software, we're actually first gonna download the Line 6 Monkey. I know, it's a weird name. For the operating system, choose what you're using. In this video, I'm using Windows 10. Click go. The most current version of the software is usually at the top. So just download and install the Line 6 Monkey. The Line 6 Monkey software acts as a hub where you can download drivers, update firmware, and download other software. So once you have it installed, open it up and see if it gives you the option to download drivers. If it does, install those. And if it gives you the option to download the Pod HD 500X edit software, do that as well. If you're not seeing the options to do that, you can just do it manually too. Under the software dropdown, you can choose drivers, download and install those. Then also choose the Pod HD 500X edit software, download and install that as well. It's probably also gonna have you download the Line 6 license manager. If it does, download and install that as well, and then sign in with your Line 6 account. With all that downloaded and installed, turn on your 500X and connect it to your computer with the USB cable. Open up the 500X edit software and if everything is installed correctly, you should see your presets start to populate in the software. If it's saying that your 500X isn't connected, you may want to try restarting your computer and trying again. Also, see if your device is showing up in the Line 6 Monkey software and if it's wanting you to download or update anything. You may need to have it search for devices. Once everything is working and you're seeing your presets show up in the edit software, the very first thing I recommend doing is saving a backup of all your presets. The easiest way to do this is to save the bundle. A bundle is all of the set lists and all of the presets and everything on the 500X all saved together in a single file. To do that, click file, save bundle as, and then choose on your computer where you wanna save it. You can also save individual set lists, just double click a preset in the set list you wanna save to activate that set list. File, save set list as, choose where you wanna save it. And you can also save individual presets. Just double click it, make sure it's activated with a little cursor next to it, save as. Okay, now that you have all the software installed and your presets are all backed up, it is finally time to load those amazing presets that you've downloaded from people onto your 500X. If you want to install a single preset, choose the preset that you want to overwrite, double click it so that it activates it, go to File, Open, navigate to the folder where your presets are saved, select the preset you want to load up, hit Open, and there's your new preset. You'll notice that the name is in yellow and it's italicized. This means that it's loaded, but it's not officially like permanently saved on the 500X yet. You're gonna need to save this. So you can do it two ways. If it's currently selected like this, like highlighted, you can come up to here to where it says send, click send selected. It'll load onto your 500X. Also, if that preset is currently loaded up on the 500X, you can go ahead and just use the save commands on the pedal board itself. To load an entire set list, it's gonna work pretty much the same way. Activate a preset in the set list that you wanna overwrite. Go to File, Open Set List, choose your set list, open it. The entire set list is gonna be overwritten with the new set list. All right guys, that's how you load presets onto your 500X. If you're interested in checking out presets that I've made, link down below. Catch you guys in the next video. Later.